Okay. So here is the emotive epoch, which I have put on your hand like this. And these are the music's AB920s. And you <clears throat> get glasses and put them like this. Later, right here on the lenses, I will be interfacing two places, those two PlayStation 2 um, cameras. I'll be putting them right here so I can see what, what they're seeing right on my screen. And I, <clears throat> this is going to be like seeing through the screen, but able, being able to put different objects and whatnot. You'll be able to look at a certain pattern on the wall and it will represent something different because you're looking through a lens. And they shoot at 120 frames per second. Our eyes only receive it at um, what 60 frames per second. So it's going to be a great pairing um, for this set. They they already sell them like that, but to get that to get that set up, it is um, I believe 700. No, um, I think it's I think it's 700 dollars for that. Um, either 700 or like 2,000 or 5,000. Can't even remember. Crazy amount. Pay fifty dollars for two PlayStation cameras, which is what I know will be better than those cameras in which they're selling. You gotta do a little interfacing by yourself. Hopefully, I'll may be even able to offer a service where you send me your send me your headset and cameras and whatnot, and charge a little fee, and then I'll do it for you. But <clears throat> we'll see how that goes. Um, we'll see how it goes with the the setup which I have right now. Um, these the headset. <clears throat> I'm going to be using for is to get an immersive view of my plane, of course, and especially when I go out. When I go out, um, I'm going to need a way to look at my video, and I want to be able to look at my video and look back at my computer screen and see all of my <clears throat> see all of my um, gauging and all my my sensor output. So, but these are great. They have a new model coming out. I think they said sometime this year, but this interfaces with the computer through a VGA port. Um, the VGA out on your computer comes into this. You have your little sensor as well. And you also have a USB port for um, for your um, powering, powering. You also can hook up a little, a little sensor right here, which I am using so you can get the orientation of your head. And this is going to be awesome. But they just started selling this. I've been waiting for a long time. They just they finally started selling them separate. And it came out to like two hundred dollars. Small, small, small little piece hooks up into this little port. Two hundred dollars. So I'm gonna have to wait on that because I was spending way too much money as you can see. <clears throat> and as you can see by the quality of the of the picture, uh, my H D picture, just just one of my webcams. Um <clears throat> But this thing actually has um, the email to epoch, which I forgot to say, actually has a gyro in it, but it is not very accurate. Like it's not as good as the gyro um, setup, the IMU setup on the half for my um, glasses, and these will interface directly to servos on the plane. So where the where my head goes, the camera looks as well. <clears throat> And it has compass there, so it'll be extremely precise. Um, this will be okay for just right now because I don't have anything else. <laughs> but um, let me stop the video <clears throat> so it can compress. And I'll be giving you more videos as well. Um, <clears throat> you can go to Vuzix, probably Vuzix.com, and pick these up. You can go to emotiveepoch.com to pick up the emotive headset. They have different um, SDKs for different, um, if you're a software developer or if you're a school or a research developer, you have different licenses for your different things. Right now I only have the um, software developer and I definitely want to get the next upgrade so I can get the raw data from the email to pop to do other different things. And they have other programs, um, so they're open source programs that can take the information from the little EEG pods and do different things with them. Do we put in different al algorithms to um, take different informations from your brain? It's really um, awesome stuff, man. Like you should really get into it. And I hopefully be able to educate a lot of people on 
things that are going on. There will be a lot of interesting videos for you to watch and a lot of different different experiments for you to see me go through. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Cut.